Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. If you missed day videos day one, two, three, four, five, and six, I'm gonna leave a nice little snippet of what you're missing out on. And right after that, um, you know, just enjoy the episode number seven, the last one before the final. Ooh, wait. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. 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 Oh, well, ah. Uh, Hey, uh, well, ah, uh, oh, 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 I just, oh, 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 my, I, mm. oh, um, and, uh, um, 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 and, uh, um, 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 Woo! Dea curva. Uh, uh, am I? Okay. Let's go do whatever, Din. Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to day number seven of the Deadman Mode tournament. And, uh, well, it's still kind of day six, right after I maxed the account. I just ended the stream, uploaded a video, and, uh, I said I'm going to bed. Well, um... I am not going to bed. I need to do some quests. I need to complete the Crystal Shield questline because I don't have DFS yet. And even if I even if I end up getting a DFS, I still want to use Crystal Shield in the final area because I don't want to get sniped for a DFS. Pretty much simple as that. Um, now Crystal Shield requires me to complete quite so many quests. It takes about 3-4 hours alongside waiting for a messenger. So it's currently 1.30 a.m. I'm gonna be staying up until I finish all the quests. And then I'll be going for a long sleep after that. So, with that being said, um, hopefully you will enjoy today's video. Some questing at the start, then I assume I'll go to bed, and then I'll wake up and I'll do Cerberus on stream. So it should be a pretty exciting one. Um, also, as you can see, I'm lagging a little bit. That's because I'm rendering the video and my CPU is on 100. But either way, um, yeah, I'm gonna jump into the questing right after my video renders. Plague City, done. I think this unlocks me a uh, Ardun teleport as well. That's kind of cool. Um, let's continue with the next one. Ah, uh, going through a little bit of a stressful situation right now. I just uploaded day six, but then realized I miss, uh, missed the editing and now it's a bit stressful. I'm re-uploading, everything is all over the place. Either way, I've still managed to complete this quest while re-rendering an entire video. And hopefully that's what I had to say. I don't know what I had to click. I'm uh, pretty dead inside. But there we go. Biohazard is done. I'm happy. Uh, let's continue with more quests. Here we go, underground pass about to be done, and I think I have two more to do right here after I speak here with the king. Boom, boom, left, right, and some agility, some attack, and Ivan staff, we will take it. All right, let's uh, get all the items needed for the next one. So two more to go, I believe. So hopefully, fingers crossed, no PKers. So far, I have seen one person questing with me and uh, no PKers. Oh, it's always so good finishing this quest because you know you are almost done. Just one more to go, man. This is a is an annoying one. Regicide out of the way. Do I get anything? No, nope, but 15k. Hey, we take those. This is like what? Like one brew. Um, wait. Which one is the next one? I need to do one more, and then I have a shield, a crystal shield, and that's uh, that's gonna be amazing. Then we just need to imbue it, and we can go to bed. It's 5 a.m. I should be sleeping, but I'm not because I'm questing and it's good because there's no PKers. Oh, there we go. We're finishing the quest. We're going for shield. Oh, yes. There it is. The shield is unlocked. Oh, my God. Finally, we are quested, fully quested, man. Oh, yes. Well, I'm going to buy a new one as well with the cash. Let me just look at the guy and how what I need to do. I think I can just maybe train him. Oh, I can. Oh, they made this pretty easy. Nice. Okay, so basically I'll just go to the Nightmare Zone now and uh, imbue this. That's really good, actually. It's pretty easy to imbue these. Oh, oh man. You guys, you guys have no idea how happy I am right now. So many things. Like, oof. I, I, I'm kind of speechless, right? Because I've been up for so long that my mind is kind of not functioning anymore. But we have done every single quest that we wanted to do. Tomorrow is the day for Cerberus. I'm excited for that. But now I'm going to go for a actual proper sleep. 
All right, I've done about 11, I say, I think 11 kills so far, and I kind of figured out the inventory setup that I want to run. The reason for the magic short in my inventory is so I can escape, DDS for the special attack, whip for, you know, DPS, tanky, as tanky as possible with the dragon boots, you know, and uh, basically that is the setup. Um, and yeah, I can get like 3 to 4 kills a trip, it's not nothing ideal. Uh, nothing ideal, but uh, we're gonna see how long we can stay here. Maybe we get lucky. Like last season, we got um, last season we got three crystals, I think, two primordials, one pagasian. This time around, I do want to get eternal, uh, but if I don't, that's perfectly okay. Um, but yeah, the kill goes something like this: spec him out, just pray flick through it, and uh, the reason for this restore instead of prayer potion is in case I need to brew during the fight, I can just restore back up, and I don't need to waste the sand fuel. Uh, okay, so I'll be killing this for a bit. I don't know if I will record much of it. I guess I'll see with the time. We are on uh, 25kc right now. Uh, so far we have gotten about 700k worth of drops, but nothing notable just yet. I think I'll do updates every 25 kills or if I get something cool. Uh, but yeah, kind of chilling here. I, I reckon I'm going to do this until I have one crystal. And then after that, I might go back to Wilderness and just kill more Wilderness monsters and, uh, you know, hunt for the PvP weapons. I think that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll change my mind in the process. You never know, but that's the idea I have for the moment. Okay. All right, that's like a supply drop, but that's one of the good ones. Thought it was something cool because it shined, but it wasn't. Ooh, 93! 93. 93 Slayer, I had no idea it was coming. Nice, okay. Um, I'm not gonna be going for a Colts this tournament because I just don't think it's worth it. Um, but there you go, man, 93 Slayer. Kinda cool. Here we go, we are now officially over 50kc at Cerberus. We have made about 1.2 million profit so far. Um, if it was an 07, but even if it's not, you get quite a lot of rune drops that you can just alk and then maintain your stay here. The sharks are kind of expensive though. There's about two, they're about two to three k each. Um, but you know, I think we make the money back, so it's not that big of a deal. But yeah, 50 kc done. Um, 75 more to be in the drop rate for. Um... Oh, I'm dying. Holy fuck, I'm trolling. Yeah, I cannot talk and do this at all. I'm the worst. Elite again, that's the second elite, man. Oh man, in 52, 59kc I've got an elite twice, dude. Ah, uh, but why, man? <sighs> Whatever, dude. Wait, Admiral got something. Admiral got something, now what is it? Run, you fool, run. Wait, what was it? Never react like this before you get out to safety. That's the first thing. Vesta Spear. <laughs> you are trolling, man. <laughs> he got the Vesta Spear. <laughs> oh, that's the worst, man. 75kc. Still no sign of, um, you know, any crystals. So far we have killed... Uh, well... Yeah, I kind of logged, but so in the last 23kc we got about 700k loot, so pretty decent, but uh, man, I wish I had all of the loot tracker on the side. Either way, we are probably just breaking even because of all the food expenses, but I'm just gonna do this until I get this one crystal, because I wanna, wanna see, I wanna see what we get, you know, and then uh, we're gonna probably go back to wilderness and try to get another pvp weapon or something like that, or maybe some barrels, I don't know, we're, just, we're gonna change it around and see what we get, but first... We still have 60 Hellhounds left to go, so that takes a long time. Another Elite, you are trolling, that's the third Elite. Ah, oh, that's the third Elite. I know it's just an extra drop on the table, but the chance... Ah, oh, it just triggers me, man. Ah, oh, it triggers me, dude. It tickles me in the wrong way. Fuck's sake. So, I had to pause the Cerberus for a little bit. Now, last season, in that KC, I already had all three of the crystals. This season, we got three Elite Clue Scrolls, so the difference is definitely there, but I'm not gonna give up just yet. Now, the thing is, though, I need to get this, um, I need to get my Nightmare Zone points up, because 
I think I need 650k to imbue a ring. Um, and I don't want to leave, leave that like alone until the very, very end. I want to finish it right now. And this is perfect time to also edit the video. Um, now I'm going to take a couple of moments here to talk about like the final hour. There's a lot of new faces, a lot of new subscribers to the channel. And people don't know how Deadman mode really ends. So basically... Uh, this whole week was a preparation for a one final massive fight. Now, that final uh, fight takes place tomorrow, 8 p.m. GMT. You can watch it live on RuneScape, uh, RuneScape's official Twitch stream. Um, I personally don't stream the multipart. I only start the stream when I get to 1v1s or if I die. And then I commentate the basically the whole tournament from my point of view. So if I die, I just commentate RuneScape's POV. And if I don't die, I just, uh, you know, play my own 1v1s and see how far we can get. Now, firstly, it's fair to say that as a content creator, I often get targeted in multi-zones. So if that is the case, there's not really much I can do about it. That's also one of the reasons why this is going to be the last Deadman mode, because... They are going to completely revamp the game mode and hopefully make it better to where solo player, for example, actually has a chance of winning. That's one of those ideas that I had and I never understood why we have this one week long, tur long tournament and then it can all end stupidly in a massive fight that doesn't really showcase someone's true skill. In my opinion, what Deadman mode should always be is straight up 1v1s. Uh, I've always been talking about that and I always get disappointed when I die in the multi stage but this time I'm not going to be disappointed if I do end up dying in the multi because this tournament has been really phenomenal for me. We have reached just about 70,000 subs, insane support on all the videos. I got the chance to collaborate with some like really talented artists. By the way, if you haven't checked the artist of my thumbnails out yet, definitely Give it a, give give her at least a follow on Twitter, and while you're doing that, give me a follow as well because why not? Um, but yeah, I got to collab with some amazing people, and it, it's just it's just it was just a really awesome last tournament, and I don't want it to like end in a bad way. For example, if tomorrow something goes wrong, so um, I will do my best. And uh, sorry, cause there was like no crystal from Cerberus. I know I'm rambling right now, but I just wanna make sure that everyone's expectation isn't that I'm gonna win, because realistically, like there's 90% chance that I die in the multi part. Um, but either way, that is for tomorrow. I will be showcasing the gear and everything that I have tomorrow. Uh, I don't want to leak anything too much before the whole thing happens, because who knows who's gonna try to snipe us or whatever. I don't have anything special. Uh, but you never know. And if I have one word for the class, please let me let me get to one v wise man. I just want to fight in the end. The most fun that I've ever had playing this video game is getting to those 1v1s, streaming it, and having a ton of fun. But with all that being said, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching me and listening to me here in the end ramble a little bit as well. I'll be putting this video out here and uh, tomorrow, mark your calendars, watch the event, and let's all have fingers crossed that the Jagex manages to get one event where they don't really fuck it up. So yeah, uh, with that being said, I'll be ending the video. I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you for watching and have a beautiful day. Bye-bye.